Andy Grammer is in the studio right now. Come guys, let's give him a round of applause. Yeah. Oh, Andy. What's up, man? Thank you very much for stopping by. We do appreciate you, man. You Good got a big show today. Yeah, yeah, we're playing at the Hard Rock. It's going to be awesome. Yeah, now, like, is this your first time in Biloxi, or have you been here a few times? You know, I think this is my first time in Biloxi. Really? Yeah, okay. I've been to Mobile, which isn't too far, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah. I love you, it down here. A few crappy movies were filmed there, but it's all <laughs> oh. right. I, I like it, I like it. Uh, again, we have Andy Grammer, Gorilla awesome. Girl, Danny Donner. We're actually streaming this thing live right now on Facebook, so hey, if you guys want to jump on this, get on it. So uh, Andy Grammer. Me learning about you on the internet. I, I, I didn't know, really know a lot about you. Okay, cool. But Gorilla Girl is more in that age bracket that kind of grew up with you. Got what it. Me learning. I didn't know you were a street performer. Yeah, totally. And, and you were, that was in Santa Monica, right? Yep. Tell me a little bit about that, because a lot of people who listen to us, we, we broadcast in New Orleans, mm -hmm. so a lot of people who listen to us are street performers. Yeah. So you made it from the street to the to the big labels. Pretty crazy. <laughs> it's, it's amazing. So tell us, what was the one thing you remember from performing the street that helps you now as a performer? Uh, you know what it is. You just have to be able to blow someone away mm. like just yeah. like the average i think a lot of performers are, have a, are a little bit of entitlement like i yeah. made this piece <laughs> of art so it's good and then yeah. usually that's not true <laughs> but when you go out on the street and you're performing the only way that someone's gonna like i don't know have you ever given money to a street performer uh, yeah. i have yes, yes I have. they gotta like blow you away yeah, yeah. they gotta yeah. be like yo that guy is bonkers yeah. he's doing he like he, either he did triple backflips <laughs> Or yeah. the hook that he's singing is like affecting me. Something has to happen that <laughs> right? is really gonna get you know, pull my wallet out and give you five dollars. Yeah. You so, know what gets me though, not yeah. to you off, What gets me are the magicians. Yeah, the ones oh, that do magic yeah. shows. Those are awesome. Yeah. They no, steal, of course. Yeah. They steal your wallet. Yeah. <laughs> they steal kidding. your I'm wallet. What happened with you? <laughs> so like that was a story. To me, that's what it is. That yeah. you know, when I go play a show, hopefully like tonight or or any song that I make that I'm gonna put on an album, it's just like it has to have that standard of is it gonna do something like really. Yeah. It can't, it, just to do it doesn't make it isn't worth it. Yeah, it's got to be like yeah. someone's got to be like, whoa, yeah, <laughs> here you go. Yeah, you're absolutely yeah. right. Yeah. Uh, Andy Grammer in here, Gorilla Girl over Hi. there. I'm Danny Donut. So yes. apparently she had a few breakups in high school and okay. she got over a lot of them with your music. Tell really? I love you, Andy Grammer. <laughs> oh, that's so wow. sweet. I literally, like when we were taking pictures, I tried to contain my excitement, but you're right now we're, we're on the mic right now, so I'm going to talk. Okay, so I love your song, Miss Me, but I had a few questions about this one music video. Keep your head up. You had Damien. From the office. Yes. Jamie in all the office. What was up with that? What Rain Wilson, you mean? Yes, Rain, Rain Wilson. Rain Wilson. <laughs> Rain He's Wilson. actually a super homie of mine. Really? He was just at my house the other day. You're uh, kidding me. Like two days ago. Yeah, he came by. Wow. He's doing a so, podcast. He had me on it. So like when you guys hang out, like, what is that like? I mean, yeah. is it funny? Always comedy. Always. Yeah, he's like, the time? he's like such a, a strange, wonderful human. Wow, <laughs> yeah. that's crazy. That's crazy. So, what's the inspiration behind that music video? Because it was like totally. It was kind of all, all over the place. Over the place. I know. She, used, she used the word random. Actually. Yeah, it was random. super random. Yeah, it was kind of like my first music video. Okay. Having a lot of fun. Just yeah, let's get this guy in it. Let's yeah. do this. It was awesome yeah, though. I appreciate it. Was it. Awesome. Thank yeah. you so much. So now, uh, Asia, she was on. Was it what was it called? The, the show she was the, the voice. voice. Yeah, she was on the Voice for a while. Now, I, I hear some audio of her. Right? Say something, I'm giving up on you. <laughs> oh, okay. But it was basically the interview that was on E, just her performing. And oh, after yeah. that was Christina Aguilera kind of critiquing. And then they went to you. Sure. Tell me about uh, y'all's experience as a couple, uh, as a married couple on that show, and watching her perform and compete. And then listening to a legend like Christina Aguilera talk about your wife. Sure. S super cool. It was really fun <laughs> to have her be a part of it. And, uh, you know, I thought she did really really good i think she did too yeah. i think it was a pretty tough song yes that mm -hmm. she was given yeah and so that was hard to, to watch them portray it like she wasn't like she chose it yeah when <laughs> that's she, what i thought when, when I saw she it. when she definitely did not <laughs> she didn't know that yeah, yeah frustrating so that was the only time i'd say frustrating but overall it was like a great experience she had a blast yeah. how does that get how, how do songs get chosen i don't understand that though is it someone like looped into a deal with the company that owns I, the show, I, honestly or? i don't know all i know is that she she like vehemently tried to change it and and wasn't allowed to and then one of the main comments was like man you should she, like, yeah. Tough, yeah. So, tough song choice. Yeah. yeah. So she, but what I was really proud of her is she stood there and like just didn't, like she, she looked so awesome yeah. dealing with yeah. the comments. Yes. And just like held herself high and it was be. really cool. You have to so be. I was happy. really, really proud of her. She seemed happy from the feedback that she wasn't yeah. dissed. She didn't feel dissed. Oh, like no. That, but yeah. that's, that's pretty cool. And I was thinking if maybe the, the, the company that puts the show on, if they choose the music, to kind of help out their spins or whatever. If let's say Suge Knight owned it, it could, oh, yeah. have, been a, it could have been a Tupac <laughs> song. She could have been doing, you know, oh, all geez. eyes on me. Yeah. Doing that. Uh, exactly. Uh, awesome. Yeah, totally. They got Andy Graham in the studio. Got awesome. Gorilla Girl, hey, Danny Donut, Vinny Beats behind here. This guy Woo. right here, he lives and dies what he does right now. So. Oh, awesome. <laughs> he used to do midget porn.
porn and then he got into this. It's kind of weird. Really great. Perfect. Hey, yeah, Andy Grammer is tonight in Biloxi, downtown Biloxi, the Hard Rock. He is performing at 8 o'clock. Tickets still available. We've been blasting out tickets all week long. Awesome, man. And Thank it's you. been a great feedback. A yeah. lot of feedback. Matter of fact, or after the morning show, we gave away five pair of tickets and people were at the door to pick them up yes. already. So cool. Mm-hmm. And, and the tickets were at Will Calls. We kind of felt kind of bad. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, guys. So you have Sorry. an album out right now that's on sale, but you're working on another album? Yeah, wow. yeah. Most of my time right now, outside of doing shows like this, like coming out, doing one-off stuff. Is uh, just writing a ton, having a blast. How really tough upset. is that? You're on the road, you're writing. Is it like, is it like, the, like an Eminem? He's like looking on the bus. He's like, yo, I'm gonna write these rhymes. I know, like, right? like that. I actually really enjoy the writing process. That's like one of, one of my favorite parts. Yeah. So right now it's pretty much like Monday through Thursday is writing, and then on like I took a, a red eye out last night to do oh, a show like this. So I'll play yeah. somewhere tomorrow, and then I'll head back on Sunday. That's so. Awesome. Cool. so it's cool. It's like the most. Uh, it's a good mix. You, know? so cool. you had a release date for that new album? Not yet. Okay. Uh, How about a title? I know you're still writing. No, nah, I know, no, yeah, I know. He's <laughs> like, good guy, I'm writing it still. So dude. for me, I like to write so much so that yeah. I can pick. Uh, Honey, I'm good was song 101 that I wrote what? for my second album. Really? Wow. So I'm about 30 in right now. It's starting to get greasy and feel good. That and was a smash so we'll hit. Though, oh, man. thank you. Yeah. That Amazing. <laughs> I was just an asset. How many things are you writing and actually become a, a 14 track CD? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, you just like. I don't want to have any filler, so I just keep, you know, keep writing. take yeah. as many swings as I can, yeah. and, and it takes a minute. It's such a, it's a, it's a really, really fun pro. I'm having the most fun I've ever had. Right You're gonna right be now. like Prince. All the great songs are gonna be like in a vault. In a vault. Somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> I think when you listen to your music, you can tell that you write it and it's from. It's yeah, real, totally. You know what I mean? Well, you know, it's funny. Like, um, have you ever seen like a, a bad movie with a great chase scene? Exactly. Yeah. Yes. That's yeah. A, yeah. A, a lot. Of, songwriting uh-huh. is a lot like that, mm-hmm. and so it just takes a lot of tries to get one that's like oh no the story's good yeah exactly. chasing sick <laughs> yeah <laughs> you got the right <laughs> actors everything's all together a lot of times you know you write a song and you're like man there's something about this that's incredible but yeah. it's not quite it's not quite yeah. right. Wow, you're describing <laughs> a chase scene. Remind me of Furious Eight. Every Furious movie, yes. like great chase scenes, not so good acting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, but but you don't want to leave the movie theater like. Uh, yeah, 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 I like, I it, like, like it. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, Andy Grammer. So. Andy Grammer in here, ninety-five-three Gorilla with Gorilla Girl and What's myself, up? Danny Donuts. He's gonna be in the Biloxi Hard Rock. To get your tickets now. Doors open at six thirty. Go to the Hard Rock or Ticketmaster.com. Any leaving words, man? Anyone What's up to- with the donuts? Do we? Do you have we donuts? <laughs> Danny uh, Donut. This is how I got that name. As okay. a young child, they, you see my daughter behind you. I was yes. the same age. I went to, I had a school bus stop next to a Krispy Kreme Donuts. You familiar? I love the, all, everything you're saying. And what, <laughs> happened, and what happened, the hot sign was on. So I would, before my bus would get there, I would jump the gate, steal the donuts, oh, because they were loading them for like uh, fundraisers. Okay. This is true. And I would take that, get back over, and hand out donuts to all the children. I the was Robin Hood of Robin Donuts. Hood. You got it. <laughs> Look at that. Danny Donuts. The uh, name never left me. I love it. That's awesome. Danny That's donuts awesome. And those donuts uh, that were brought earlier by a taxi company for some reason. And uh, they're, they're, actually, they're up front. They're called Tater Random. Nuts. They're made from potatoes. Okay. Yeah. They're very delicious. We're going to have to try one of those. Yeah, we'll see what's up. Andy Grammer. Thanks for having me, guys. Thank you so much for coming out, man. I appreciate you. Give him a round of applause. All right. Give him a round of applause.